Hey guys, this is another short tutorial on how to make a root beer float. So what you're going to need is some epoxy resin. I'm using a one-to-one -one solution. Um, I'm using a watercolor. You're going to need some little cups. i got these guys. And this also has like a little loop where you can add a jump ring. And I have some raccoon with cream honey clay and some fake ice cubes. Alright, so we're going to take the one-to-one -one solution. I like to put a couple drops of the watercolor into the third cup. Oh, maybe a big drop. Alright. So we're going to use a little um, beer sign. And that holds about six mils of fluid. So. And that also leaves a little more space at the top so you can have your whipped cream. Right. Let's have a little spatula here to get the rest out. So you're going to mix that up. Let's see. Oh, there might be a little bit darker. Let's add one more drop. Make sure you mix it up really good. And this is just watercolor again. Watercolor paint. Okay. I think we're just about done here. So now we can go ahead and pour that into our little sign. There we go. So now we have that filled. Um, I'm going to add some ice cubes to that, and you can see them floating around in the side. And then you're going to let that set up and dry. So for me, the, the casting resin I used took about, mm, I would say overnight, so 20, 12 to 24 hours. Um, and then when you're done, when that's all dry, you're not, it's going to have that little space at the top right here. So you just take your whipped cream honey and you squeeze it around the top. And then you get your, you add your uh, straw. And there you go, you get your little beer sign. And to make a pendant, all you need is a jump ring. So, alright guys, enjoy. Bye.